What's poppin' all my bosses and bosses, man? Y'all know who it is. It's cute, boss, man. Welcome back to the channel. Today we out here in Denver, Colorado, and we finna be trying Denver's most viral foods for the next 24 hours. You know what I'm saying? So if you're new to my channel, man, subscribe, comment, do all that good stuff, and let's get in here and try these foods, and I'm gonna let y'all know my honest opinion, all right? All right, let's go. So the first place we're gonna be trying is a place called Black Box Bakery, and they got viral pastries or whatnot. I don't know what to call them. We finna get in there. We're gonna try one and I'm gonna tell y'all what I think about it. You know, watch out for these bees, man. But yeah, we're gonna get in there and see what the Black Box Bakery is all about. Now, this is really tight. It's like a place with a whole bunch of different food places. Definitely a vibe. Oh, here it is. Black Box Bakery. These are the pastries. Oh, they got the ube. I'm about to try the ube. I tried that when I was in Hawaii, but I never tried it in a sweet form. So we're going to test out this ube one. And I ain't going to get too much because I still got to go um, try two other places for today. So we're just going to get the ube one. I'm not sure I think. All right. So I ordered the ube pastry. Look at that. Comes in this nice little, cute little bag. That's fly. I like that. I'm going to get up here and try this out, man. I hope it's good. Comment below if you ever had ube before. We got some sugar and stuff all on it. Okay, look at that. Let me set that this way. Ube all on the bottom. So y'all know this thing filled. Let's try. The intro squeezing out the bottom. Wow, it's not too bad. It tastes better than the ube I had in Hawaii. You wanna taste this? Oh my God. I'm not gonna lie, this is actually hella good, y'all. Y'all come out here, come try this. It's, it's really good. really messy but oh they ain't got no napkins up over there hold on let me try to see if I need a napkin hold up real quick oh yeah man I see why this place went viral this is bomb this one is I don't know about the other one but this one's bomb oh shit I just rise to match my shirt got that purple on I'm not probably look crazy right now but yeah man shout out to Black Box Bakery Y'all in Denver, come check them out if you haven't already. Busy in Denver, come check them out. It's in Edgewater, Colorado, not too far. Same thing. Yeah. Look at all that. Look at those layers, it's just so flaky. They got the sugar on the side. It's not even too sweet either. Bam. Bam.com, bruh. Oh, shit. Oh my god. Hey, this is leaking. Bro, what are you talking about, man? <laughs> All right. I'm probably finna chill out on this. It's making a mess everywhere. I said I had tried two other places. So I'm going to wrap this up and I'm going to catch you at the next location, all right? All right, y'all, so the next place we at is called TK Surf and Surf. Um, I would film inside, but they had the music playing extremely loud, so I ordered my food. I just got uh, some lobster Alfredo, and uh, we're going to check it out. I mean, I definitely want to come out here because it's black owned, so you know we got to support our people, you feel me? So, man, it looks good. It looks crazy in there. The food looks, look, y'all come to Denver, man. Make sure y'all come support. Check out TK Surf and Surf, man. They got some, let me show you what they got on here so y'all can see what they got. See? What I got here, oh look, I so I got the lobster, uh, lobster Alfredo. They got lamb chops and everything, crab legs, man, all the good stuff. They even got the little pies on the side, y'all know. 
I might go in and try to get a little B-roll for y'all, but like I said, the music's just really loud. But yeah, so I'm definitely camp over here. Support our black people, man. TK, Surf and Turf. Make sure y'all check them out if y'all in Denver. If you are in Denver, you already checked them out, man. Comment below, tell me if y'all like this place and what y'all order when y'all come here, all right? So we're going to wait for this video to come out. I'm going to tell y'all my honest review and what we got, and I'm uh, y'all going to see, all right? So be back in a second. All right, so we just got the food. It's the macaroni, asparagus. Lobster looking crazy. Steak looking crazy and very seasoned. Look at that. Oh, my God. And here's the lobster pasta that I got here. I'm assuming that must be the lobster pieces. We're going to get up in there and try it and test it out. I'm going to tell y'all what I think about it. This shit is seasoned to the max. I hate these type of noodles, I'm not going to lie. These kind, I hate these. But we're going to give it a try, man. TK Surf and Turf. Black owned. Make sure you come here and support black people, man. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna make sure I finish chewing. Yo, that's good, bro. That's so good. I'm gonna try one of these pieces of steak right here. Look at that. Look at that steak. Sorry, y'all. Uh, I wanted to chew all the way. Cause you know what I'm saying? I got comments while people saying, I need to chew my mouth closed. Never had that issue before, but obviously it's cause I'm talking and doing this vlog. I didn't want no blank ass spaces. But I'm gonna try to do better on chewing my mouth closed cause I never really noticed that. And I, I guess that could be nasty, you feel me? But that steak is crazy, that steak is bomb. I'm about to try this macaroni right here. Look at that macaroni, y'all. Uh, juicy. Did you try it? The macaroni is cool. It's cool. It's definitely different for sure. I don't even think that's mac. I don't think that's macaroni. Cheese. I think it's simply just macaroni. I'm not gonna lie. It's okay. But this pasta here, let's try some of this pasta. This pasta here is like this is good. And I hate these type of noodles. Like I literally hate these kind. I don't know why. The whole world loves them, but I hate. I only like like the little. I think they call fettuccine noodles. But this actually tastes good. And that steak is bomb. I'm gonna get my drink real quick. Oh, shit. Yeah, see, I had the Calypso last time. Now I got the uh, the Southern Peach Lemonade. It's like one of my favorite ones, bro. Oh my God. So good every time. It's the same every time, bruh. Comment below y'all favorite clips of y'all drink these. Oh my God. Can I take a piece of your lobster? I love when the lobsters is like that. Look all that seasoning on there. Crazy. Dang, bro. Oh yeah, it's supposed to be lobster. That lobster's bomb. Mm -hmm. Hope they ain't do me like that. I need to take this back if that's chicken. I'll take that. They, they, Bro, that's supposed to be lobster pasta, bro. Damn. No, that's, that's not no chicken. You can bite into it and see. The fact we got a question if it's chicken or lobster, I don't know if it's a good or a bad thing. Sounds a little off to me. It's windy out here.
steak's pretty good, though. I like the pasta. I'm not going to lie. I like it. It's cool. Macaroni. Mm, I get a macaroni. I'm going to finish chewing. I get a macaroni like a seven. This lobster pasta, whatever it's supposed to be. I give it like a nine. The steak, I get a steak a nine. And that lobster, that grilled lobster, whatever that is, super fire, bro. I get that a 10. It has like a lemon flavor to it. So it has like that little hint. Yeah. It's bomb. I didn't taste the asparagus. I'm not in the mood. I'm not in the mood for no veggie right now. And the, and the calypso, you know, you can't, you can't miss the calypso, so. Yeah, man. Shout out to TK Surf and Turf. Like I told y'all, man, black owned. Go support the people, man. Support your people, support our people. Whatever, man. It's good. I like it. So for breakfast, we had the ube, little pastry. Now we eating this. Now I'm gonna give me some dessert. And I'm gonna wrap up the 24 hours, man. Denver, so far, y'all food is good, man. I'm not gonna lie. So far, it's cool. You know what I'm saying? I'm tired of eating the regulars, Taco Bells, and McDonald's and all that other stuff, man. So, this shit got my nose running all the season up in here. So, yeah, man. Um, I'm about to finish eating this food, but it's just so hot outside. I'm about to hop in the car, eat this, and I'm going to go uh, give me some dessert. And I'm going to let y'all know what I think about that, all right? So, I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. All right, y'all. So, we're finally here at the dessert spot, a place called Sweet Sweets, and it's rated like in the top 10 out here in Denver. So I wanted to get up in there and give me some ice cream, man, because I don't have all that greasy food, and I need to just like break the acidity with some sweet. So we're going to get in and type of dope ass ice cream they got, because supposedly this is a really good place. So let's check it out. Let's see what they got. Okay, it's a nice little vibe. This is checkers, not chess. Okay. Oh, they got tic tac toe. Let me find out. All right, y'all. Y'all see my ice cream I got? Look at that. Dairy free vanilla and orange. Let me get outside so y'all can see. There we go. Now y'all see. That dairy free vanilla with the orange on there. And guess what, y'all? I just found out this place is also black owned. So that's so dope. I went to two places today that's been black owned out here in Denver, man. I know I look crazy right now with these damn glasses on. Hold up. But yes, yeah, so I'm about to try this ice cream because they said it was so good. So I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna tell y'all. Look at that. Don't that just look perfect? Whoo! Look like some fire. Oh man. That's so good. So bomb. Shout out to uh, Sweet Sweets. Black owned. I know I love that. That's so dope, man. Hold up. Come out here and support. They got every social media. Check them out if y'all here in Denver. If y'all come visit in Denver, come get y'all some ice cream. He trying to get some in the car. I don't fuck with no wasp. They got a lot of wasp out here. But yeah, man. So that was it right there. We ate at the most viral spots in Denver for the last, for 24 hours. And man. Denver got some good food. I'm gonna have to hand it to y'all. I got some pretty good food, man. Shout out to all the places we went to. And um, make sure y'all come check out the food out here in Denver. All right, y'all, man. So like I said, man, check out all the spots we checked out today. The stuff's been so good. I'm definitely like very satisfied with the food out here, man. But that's my cue and I'm out of here. So until I see y'all next time, man, like, comment, subscribe, comment below any places y'all think I should check out in your city. And um, what city I should come to? All that good stuff, all right? Y'all remain sucker free. Y'all know who it is. It's Q the Boss, and I'm going to catch you on the next one, all right? All right, let's go.